Hello everyone, this is Mike. Welcome to my channel, Mike the Tech Savvy. I'll be showing you today how to root and install a custom recovery on the international version of the Samsung Galaxy S5. It's quite a simple process if you follow all the steps in the correct order and you do not miss any of them. Let's start off going to settings, developer options. If developer options is not there, you should go to build number here and click on it seven times. In my case, it's already turned on. Now go back to developer options and check the USB debugging option here. Now restart the device into download mode. For that, just turn it off. And after the device has vibrated, start it by pressing the following combination, so volume down, home button, plus the power button simultaneously. After this warning shows up, you should press the volume up key. We'll be flashing the TWRP custom recovery first via Odin and then directly through the custom recovery will flash the root as well. Connect the phone to the PC. Now what you have to do is to open Odin the latest version. I will leave all the links in the description. You will have the Odin download link, the SuperSU download link, and last but not least, the TWRP. So as I was saying, after opening Odin and connecting the phone to the PC, make sure you have a connection here and it says added. Also an important thing to note is that you have to install the Samsung drivers and to use genuine Samsung USB cables if possible. I will also place a link for the Samsung USB drivers in the description below. To flash the custom recovery, press the AP button, select the latest TWRP TAR file. It will be displayed here. Make sure you untick the auto reboot option here and afterwards you simply click start disconnect the phone remove the back cover and the battery as well for a couple of seconds after putting the battery back in start the S5 by holding down the recovery combination so volume up plus home plus power button the latest TWRP is flashed now go to wipe format data after this step is done go to install go to the folder where you've copied the SuperSU zip file and flash it by swiping here now you can simply restart the device by clicking reboot and system do not worry if the device reboots a couple of times or if it takes a couple more minutes to boot up simply wait for it after rebooting you're free to uninstall bloatware install Edway, greenify and so much more this was basically the process of routing and installing a custom recovery on the samsung galaxy s5 once again, make sure you have the latest Samsung drivers installed on your PC, then download all the necessary files, and finally just go through the process as I've shown you previously. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to like it and to subscribe to my channel by clicking on the button that will be displayed in the bottom left part here. This was Mike the Tech Savvy, until next time. Bye!